game on fight with another video I say on fight with another video make sure you hit that like button comment subscribe yes I said subscribe turn on your post notifications it's free do it for me let's get straight into it for next two times this the mob a Memphis gang he was affiliated with before he signed with money back yo my question is why now you separated yourself years ago why send shots at him now a lot of people feel this is his way of letting it be known what side he's on after big juke died yo got it brother but i'll let y'all be the judge of that after he dissed the mob the one and only ceo jizzle spoke out and said f mob ties and fng come get up with me ceo jizzle he also spoke out on facebook and he said on jesus christ you ain't never said f the mob until you start hanging with them pallbearers you already know who the pallbearers is he talking about yo got it he talking about money back yo he's saying that all they do is bury their homies all they do is bury their loved ones because they getting spent on you know what Paul Bearers do You know what I'm saying He say What mob you dissing 20 mob or mob ties Cause you and your artist was the same one Banging tees Shit Even King Banging the mob And y'all know who King is The little 10 year old that finessed two times taking care of. So he saying You and your whole little squad Was banging the mob Now you wanna send shots and this Like let's be for real then CEO Jizzle, he tagged Stupid Duke and say, send me his paperwork. Now y'all know it was allegations a while back that Finesse two times snitched. It was even two guys that came out and said, yes, Finesse two times snitched on me. But he denied all allegations. What's up, world? This is Dedrick Munzo. It's in that Finesse case and that paperwork that's floating around. Dedrick Munzo. I don't know what else he got going, but I know in 08, that state case that I went to jail for, that I had to go to court for for five years. Yeah, that's it. This shit for real. But Finesse two times responded, and I think he responded a little too quick. He said, nah, Wigger, tell him to send you his daddy paperwork. I was in the unit with Big Larry when he took the stand on him. It's in his blood. Like I said, you wiggas talking about 08 His daddy just snitched Now he say like I said Y'all talking about 08 Y'all talking about something I did In 08 So it's finesse two times Admitting That he snitched in 08 Is he admitting that The paperwork is right But he just saying Man that was a long time ago That was in 08 and I want to ask y'all something. If a person snitched when they was younger, do that determine what kind of person they is when they get older? So if they was a snitch when they was a teenager, can they become a grown man and be a real gangster and respected in the streets? Get in the comments and let me know. He say his daddy just snitched Still snitching And gonna snitch on you If you do something in his face You wiggas kill me Now I wanna say this man And he also said Go get your get back For what happened at the farm You know CEO Jizzle was shot At the CMG Concert In Memphis Hey man, don't get on no social media trolling. Like a nigga not to be out, man. Hey man, the minute you out, I took like the way of let a fuck take me out, nigga. I don't know, I'm in pain like a motherfucker. Hey, but just a good though, man. Hey, tell them how at blogs quit posting me, dog. Ain't no doubt. Hey man, I'm a dog, man. This shit concrete, boy. Hey, man. <laughs> this shit concrete, man. Yeah. I'm a dog. I'm good, man. This shit concrete, man. For real. Stop 
supposed to be man I wrong me I'm good he was shot in his heart finesse told him go get that get back but y'all get in the comments and let me know man do y'all think finesse two times just put his foot in his mouth because y'all already know the reputation that CEO Jizzle got. Y'all know when it come to spinning or allegedly spinning, you know that anybody play with CEO Jizzle, it don't look good for him. I ain't gonna lie. Finesse, this ain't no beef with Honeycomb Brazy. This a beef with Jizzle. And I think you just put your foot in your mouth, can Y'all get in the comments and let me know, man. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on all post notifications. It's free. Do it for me. Get this video to 1,000 likes. Hey, do me a favor. Look down right there to the bottom left and hit that like button for me. Hit that like button right there. I appreciate it. I continue watching. Y'all don't know, man. I'm helping people get monetized. If y'all don't know, man, I be behind the scenes. I be behind the scenes helping these new YouTubers get monetized, helping their channel grow. A lot of people you see I do promo for, I'm behind the scenes helping their channel grow. If you a small YouTuber and you trying to get monetized, you need a thousand subscribers, you need 4,000 watch hours, hit me up on Instagram at music101ceo. And we're going to get the business club, man. I'm going to put something right here, man. You can see this young lady right here, she put the work in. She listened to what I said, and she put the work in, and she got results quick as a motherfucker. You hear me? Listen, I thought it was a glitch. I ain't going to lie. She is the fastest growing YouTuber that I ever gave advice or help in my life. For real. Because a lot of y'all be procrastinating. It's a lot of YouTubers that I took under my wing and they not consistent. This young lady right here, she was consistent. I told her I did. I gave her some tips in less than a week. Less than a week. Her numbers triple. Her numbers triple. A month later, she monetized. Man, listen. If you're trying to win, Hit me up on Instagram, Music101, see yo. Every day you Every day you wake up, you need to promote your company. Every day you wake up, you need to promote your brand. A lot of people don't like to pay for promotion. Well, guess what? You need to turn into a promoting guru. Marketing is the number one key to success. A lot of people is not making it in life when it comes to company businesses or music or talent, whatever it is, the product you're selling, whatever it is, because not enough people have seen or know you exist. You can have the best product in the world. You can be the best rapper in the world. You can have the best company in the world. But if we don't know you exist, how can we engage? You need to put it in their face every day. You post it every day. I don't care if you get one like, post it again, post it again, post it again. They either go and follow you or they go engage. If I see something come across my phone five, six times, I'm going to eventually tap on it to see what it's about. Marketing, promoting is the key to success. Y'all better get to it. Music 101. Promo alert. Listen, if you guys want promo, DM me on Instagram at music101ceo. Music101ceo. I'm doing $20 promo. For $20, you will get one video promoted on my YouTube channel. For $40, I will promote three videos for you in my YouTube channel. $60, I'll promote six videos for you in my YouTube channel. And $120, I will promote 12 videos for you on my YouTube channel. You need YouTube promo? You trying to get your business up? You trying to run your numbers up? Hit me up at Music 101 CEO. Hey, you don't want to miss it. The results is great. Thank you, Music 101 CEO. Thank you, baby. We're on the road to 100K, and I need y'all help. 
all you got to do is hit that subscribe button when you see my videos hit that like button it helped push my videos in the algorithm it helped more people see my videos and it also give me a chance to get more subscribers y'all already know i can't do it without y'all man